This is 200,000 damage. I'm trying to hit 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. You can help by liking, subscribing, and sharing. Thank you. What's going on YouTube? It's Sora or Sora Thin, and in this video we're gonna be playing some more random dice. Roll roll. I've got a new deck that I've been using a lot, and we're gonna try it out today and see what we can do with it. The idea is you get the shields in the front with the transcendence dice behind it. Try to get the transcendence dice to six pip with the mimic dice while building engineers in the back. Hopefully there's no assassins that we go up against, but let's go. Alright, it begins. So the reason I like the mimic and transcendence dice combo is because you can transcend them together and it will always become another transcendence dice, even if the mimic dice is used. Alright, looks like they got level up dice, charge dice, zombie dice, all the dice I don't really like, but we'll see how we can do against it. The charge dice being in the front, I've noticed is a really good, really good tactic because it stuns everything right away. But if you have shields in the front, it almost doesn't matter as our engineer and transcendence dice does all the damage that we need to take out the guest. We'll do the transcendence dice upgrade, of course. We'll put the thorn shield next to the charge dice so that the charge dice takes damage from the thorn shield. And then we'll put our transcendence dice right here. Luckily, they don't have spears or anything, so we don't have to worry about pierce damage. Alright, they got the charge dice still here. That's perfect. There it goes, killing itself immediately off of the thorn dice. Looks like the level up dice did level up twice. That's not good. Uh-oh, 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 oh my goodness. Okay, so level up dice and heal dice combo seems to be what this guy's going for. That's not good. But look at all these transcendence dice we just got. Holy moly. Okay, alright, so we need to be stronger up against these level up dice so that it can't level up anymore. I think we should just go for this, even though it's probably gonna kill a lot of our shields. Okay, okay. We just need to kill this level up dice really quickly before the heal dice can get to it. Oh, when it levels up, it heals all the way? Is that true? Oh, no. That's really good. That's really good. We might have to combine our transcendence dice just so we can attack this thing better. We'll do Vanguard, of course. Vanguard is my favorite. And then we got our transcendence dice set up. Hopefully, we can take out this level up dice before it can take out any of these fellas. Uh, let's go. Oh, they, have, they just have so many level up dice. And they got a charge dice coming straight to the back to help take care of the engineer, which wasn't really doing anything in the first place. But their level up dice somehow died. I didn't even see how. I'll have to go back in the video and highlight it. But look at this. The transcendence dice level up was definitely the right move as we take out everything else. Alright, we got another transcendence dice to add. Another shield and another engineer. Let's go. Alright, their level up dice is level 4 now which is scary, scary. But we got our transcendence dice taking out everything around it. So hopefully they can all focus it now. But they're not because they're going to be focusing on the zombies which keep multiplying. They just keep multiplying. There's just so many targets. It's an apocalypse, everybody. It's an apocalypse. I'm going to do rapid growth and hope that we can get a six pip transcendence dice right here. So close, but not quite. If we just had this five, then we would have gotten a six pip transcendence dice. If we can win this, then we might actually see a six pip transcendence dice in the next round because we'll have another round available if we do win. We just gotta be very, very careful. We need to take out that level up dice right away. Okay, our transcendence dice are doing a lot of damage. The healing dice just try to heal it, but not enough. The level up dice does go down. The zombie dice are absolutely multiplying out of control again, but hopefully we can take out everything as and focus on the zombies, which we are now, but it looks like they are gonna start multiplying again. Healing dice is gonna heal them up a little bit, potentially. Nope, not quite. Healing dice is just not strong enough, so we are gonna end up taking out the healing dice at the end, which means another victory. All right, let's get a six pip transcendence dice, shall we? Here we go ladies and gentlemen five pip transcendence five pip transcendence boom holy six pip transcendence dice this thing's gonna be busted all right let's see what this thing can do i'm ready all right here we go oh my god is that twenty thousand damage oh my god look at it go and it pierces this is 200,000 damage! That's 200,000 damage! Oh my god! Oh my god! If you could see the look on my face right now. Holy crap! That was 200,000 damage and pierce from this little guy. Oh my god. What a giga chad. Thank god we had our mimic dice or else we wouldn't have been able to do that. Folks, make sure you use this combo. I can't stress enough. That is the comeback central right here. All right, let's try to get it again. That was so awesome. I still can't get over that. 200,000 damage. Holy crap. All right, our shields take the initiative. The broken dice don't know who to attack, so they're gonna even out all the damage against everyone everybody, which is probably going to end up making them lose in the long run as our transcendence dice dwindles everybody. We're going to increase the transcendence dice, of course, and this seems good. They do have the spear dice. We do have to be very careful of that because of the pierce. So we're going to do something a little bit 
like this because we don't want any pierce damage going on because that pierce damage on the second target that it pierces it's incredible all right they got a spear dice right here good thing we moved our transcendence dice we'll also be taking mega damage right here we end up taking it out almost immediately taking out what was this an assassin yeah an assassin trying to take care of our engineer but not in time as we take out their last shield dice oh the broken dice unleash all their ultimates at once doing a lot of split damage against everybody they are gonna unleash another ultimate but it's not gonna be enough damage because of our shield unleashing its ultimate incredible all right lots of mimic dice lots of transcendence dice i like what i see i like what i see all right we've got our four pip transcendence dice and this thing just has so much health i think we could actually use it as a tank and just put it in the front well, so we're gonna see how that works out and go so it's going up against two shields right in a row but it's gonna take one down and two hits another down and one hit take out the spear in one hit take out the other spear in one hit take out everything else in one hit all these assassins while the poison dice dwindles its health a little bit but it's just absolutely tanking it because oh my god it's so strong all right we're gonna do vanguard of course and we'll do something like this we got the four pip three pip and then our engineers in the back let's go all right they got the spear dice but we don't have anything for them to pierce which is good the assassin dice comes up from the back but archer sentence dice says no thank you uh these come up from the back also but archer sentence dice are still politely saying no thank you and then the broken dice is gonna unleash its ult as it dies immediately that was really quick all right we'll do two more games and try to get this transcendence dice to level six again because that was awesome what is this rebirth gains 15 percent mp only when oh shit i gotta go Ooh, that was close once reaching full mp brings allies back to life with 84 percent hp holy crap so we're gonna have to kill the entire team twice oh and all the toxin is gonna absolutely dwindle us but oh no, if only we had a little bit more damage. The Medusa dice is annoying as well. The Medusa dice and toxic dice combo is good because it will freeze my dice while it is in the toxin. We'll do magic. Pa no, because Transitus dice doesn't use MP. We'll do power repair just because we're going to have to be fighting them twice. It will make sense to be strong uh, coming the second round. Okay, well, I totally ran out of time while I was just absolutely blabbering my mouth. Uh, but unfortunately, our thorn is going to be in the back, which will be fine because it won't take any damage from the toxin, presumably. Uh... Oh, never mind. There's another toxin. Well, this just looks really bad. Okay, let's actually focus this time. I've right, got lots of transcendence dice. Very good. All right, we're going to try to space our transcendence dice away from the toxin dice using our shields as the middle. We'll see how that works out. They have a four pipped thorn dice. Not good. We're going to take out everything around it. I don't know if the thorn dice works against ranged dice. It doesn't look like it, which is good for us. The revive dice is going to do some absolutely weak DPS, but DPS nonetheless, as we slowly dwindle down this thorn shield's health. Ooh, okay, it did do a lot of damage. I wonder if that was from its ability. But we take it down. Hopefully, we can take this down. But no, with the added support of the revive dice, I don't think we're going to be able to do it. Let's see how much health it has. Will we have DPS? No. And even if we did kill it, it would have revived every single one of the dice, which is just absolutely phenomenal. We'll do elite squad and we'll get our four pip and three pip in the middle here so we can do as much damage as we can to these toxins as soon as possible so that the toxin goes away as soon as possible they have four toxins one is five pip we are absolutely screwed Hold on, hold on. We're staying out of the fight pip toxins cloud as we barely take any damage from the other pip toxin cloud and we actually win. All right, let's bring it home now, shall we? All right, they got their fight pip toxin dice over here now. Oh, their charge dice absolutely demolishes our transcendence dice that was right here, which is not good. Our four pip looks like it is gonna go down pretty early as well. We have all of our engineer turrets doing damage to kind of everybody on the field, not really directing it towards one, which is probably gonna end up losing for us. An unfortunate loss, but not the end of the world. Let's get that six pip transcendence dice in the next game, shall we? Here we go. Oh, beautiful start. We're gonna leave the mimic dice in hopes that we get a transcendence dice next round. So we're just gonna put them right here in the back. All right, two assassin dice. That's pretty scary, but we're gonna take out the healing dice, which isn't gonna do anything for them because the assassin dice are back here. Uh, and then eventually take out the assassin dice as well with our transcendence dice. Incredible. We're gonna do berserk. Look at that. All four out of five is our transcendence dice showing up. That's awesome. All right. This this looks like a perfect setup to me. Let's go. Oh, uh, they have Toxin, of course. I need to start paying attention to what they have because they also have the Spear Dice, which is going to do Pierce damage and pretty good Pierce damage at that. So we need to pay attention to that and stop putting our Transcendence Dice directly behind the shields as we tank the Toxin Clouds. And no, go, go, go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, that was close. All right, we get a few more Transcendence Dice to upgrade. All right, I like this. Let's do it. I'm going to use our four Pip Transcendence Dice as a tank again because it seemed to work really well last time because it does kind of just kill everything everything before it even gets to the transcendence dice. All right, they have more healing dice. They finally brought out the fire dice, which is worrying, but not the end of the world. The toxin dice is going to do a lot of damage to our transcendence dice, this one and this one, but we're going to be able to take out the healing dice before we die. Yes, we are. And can we take out this one with our shield dice? Oh, it gets the shield down. Oh, but there's a big damage. No, 
no. All right, we got to do rapid growth. Get this six pip transcendence dice right away. All right, we got three. That's good. All right, we got our five pip. We're so close. I'm honestly kind of hoping we lose this round just because I really, really want to get this transcendence dice up to pier six. Okay, here we go. This S dice is going to TP straight behind our tier two uh, transcendence dice, but it's going to get turned around on as we take out their healing dice, both of them. And then hopefully we stay out of the Toxin Cloud. We don't, but we're going to kill it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Come on, six pip chain and dice. Let's go. Uh, unfortunately, we don't get it. I really hope we lose this round, honestly. I'm actually going to try to throw this round just so we can lose and try to get the chain and dice to tier six because I really want to see that again. Let's see if us intentionally throwing will actually end up in a victory. We are staying out of the Toxin Cloud for now. Toxic Cloud is going to come up a little bit closer, which is going to do lots of damage. And it looks like we are going to win either way because of our turrets, at least. No, I want to see the Transcendence Dice again. All right, folks, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully in the next episode, we'll get to see the Tier 6 Transcendence Dice again because that was freaking awesome. Make sure to use this deck. Let me know how it works out for you. Let me know any decks you want me to use in the future and any dice you want me to use in the future. Make sure to join the Discord so we can discuss further. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.